Hello everybody, welcome back to another Fallout 4 Level 4 Weapon Merchant Location Guide and today I am very, very, very happy to be bringing you guys the guide on the scribe. Now I've been holding out uh, with these guides a little bit, although you can find them all from the very, very start of launch day, you could find all of them. Uh, most of them were broken, so the only ones that actually really work are the Voltet rep here and Ar Anne Hargraves there. Trader Riley can be brought to a settlement, but she's bugged out, and the rest of the uh, the guys are all bugged out. They disappear. They don't come to uh, where you want them to go, and all sorts of things like that. So. I've been holding off on the guides, bringing a few now and again. Uh, I think there's one or two I've done now where uh, I've showed where to find these things, but explained uh, very clearly that you cannot get these in settlements. Some people have been lucky. Some people uh, have managed to get them assigned and trading with, but uh, for the most part, they are absolutely bugged out to hell until, 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 until now. So at this very moment in time, I am running the Fallout 4 1.4 uh, update beta so uh, I think this is only available for PC at the minute so I'm sorry to the console guys if uh, this is wrong but it will be very soon before um, this will be released and you'll be able to get it so at the minute in the beta the scribe now works so obviously to get the scribe you're going to need a level 4 armor trading stand so you can get that in your build menu you're going to need a couple of perks think local leader 2 and cap collector uh, before you can uh, actually build it and for the scribe you need a minimum population of 10 so as you can see right now I've got 15 people in sanctuary so I qualify to get the scribe 10 population minimum and a level 4 uh, sorry level 3 trading post so after that I'm going to show you the best way to get the scribe now this worked really well for me there are a couple of locations where you can actually pick up these random encounters but the best is right here on the Cambridge police station so you can see this right here it's where you go to meet the Brotherhood of Steel um, and Paladin dance for the first time uh, but there you go you want to go to the Cambridge police station now this is the best way I could think of doing it like I said there are a couple of random spawn locations for these guys um, you've got the uh, smiling Larry I think and the scribe will both appear at this location now I haven't tested smiling Larry yet in the patch notes it says the scribe has been fixed no one else uh, I've tried Trader Riley again she is not fixed so at the minute I think it's just the scribe but if you come here scribe and smiling Larry will appear so what you want to do is run down the alleyway to the right hand side as you spawn into the Cambridge Police Station. Once you uh, actually come here, uh, get, run down the road and hit this car just here. And what we're going to do is save it right now. This is going to uh, set up our farming of uh, the scribe. So basically what you're doing is saving this location, running around, spawning these guys. And if you don't get them, then just reload exactly where you was at that car and then you can just run down the road again and it will be a different random encounter every single time so if you don't hit him reload do it again and eventually he will appear now as you can see i was really really lucky here first attempt and there is the scribe walking around the corner so this is a random encounter zone it could be absolutely nothing it could be some super mutants it could even be smiling larry or some other random challenges but you want to keep going until you hit the scribe. Uh, he will offer to trade with you. You can have a quick look through his inventory. It's uh, not bad really, but it's pretty crap until you actually make him uh, a level 4 merchant, which uh, I will show you exactly how to do. But basically what you want to do, is after you've looked through his inventory if you want to, you want to talk to him again and then hit work for me right there at the top. That will uh, ask him to come and work for you. He will nicely agree and then you can send him anywhere you want. Absolutely anywhere you want. So I'm going to send him to Sanctuary Hills. And uh, then you've just basically got a, a bit of a wait. Uh, so he's actually going to get there. He is going to walk there. Uh, you can escort him there if you uh, really want to spend absolutely ages uh, following him. He's quite a slow guy. He tends to stroll around a little bit. Um, best idea as well. He, I think he can die as well. Um, I've read somewhere that he can actually die. So if he comes across... Uh, you know some enemies if he ran into a death claw I'm pretty sure the death claw could kill him so you might want to escort him I couldn't be bothered with that though you can also send him to uh, I think Hangman's Alley is the closest settlement to uh, this place right here so that wouldn't be a bad idea send him there and then he'll definitely be safe uh, but after that you're just basically going to want to uh, travel to uh, the opposite side of the map that will waste a bit of time 
think that passes a few hours and then what I tend to do is uh, just go to a bed and sleep for uh, at least 24 hours I really do recommend 48 hours though that will give him enough time to make it all the way to uh, Sanctuary Hills where I have sent him and there you go uh, we've waited our 48 hours we've traveled back to Sanctuary and I've actually found him right here he seems to be uh, in the tater patch getting some food on the go so once he is back at your settlement that is really good progress right now because before this uh, this beta patch he uh, he wouldn't actually make it here he disappeared to this top Not secret room which you've probably seen on a previous uh, level 4 merchant guide that I've done so all you want to do now is open your workshop menu and then simply click on him uh, and then assign him to the level 4 emporium so uh, we're going to go over right now we've selected uh, the scribe and we're going to go to the armor emporium and then I'm just going to hit enter that will assign him to that emporium and now as soon as it says there at the top left this resource is now assigned you don't even have to wait for him to get to the weapon trading stand uh, you can just simply go up to him and he's automatically a level 4 trader right now so I'll show you guys we'll go ahead we'll go and chat to him now his inventory will be a hell of a lot better and I mean a hell of a lot better so this is uh, really really good actually because he now will sell as you can see right there straight away the apocalypse chess piece is now available we couldn't get that before because uh, obviously he was bugged out and uh, he also sells some mark 4 synth items as well which is really good because you can get the mark 2 and 3 from the institute uh, but you could never get the mark 4 so now you've got the mark 4 uh, synth items as well I'm going to do a separate guide on that so don't worry about that guys but I think that is really good now all I do now is uh, go ahead and sit down or sleep somewhere for another 48 hours and uh, he should make his, his way over to his stand and here you go as you can see now he is waiting uh, well, walking towards his stand and he will eventually get to it and stand behind it like the Voltec rep and uh, and Hargreaves that you've seen who are already there. So there you go guys. That is a nice unbugged fixed scribe to uh, actually get in your settlement. Now I'm really happy to have done this. I've been calling for it for a long time. But uh, unfortunately there are still uh, the other guys which are bugged like Smiling Larry, um, Trader Riley, people like that. So hopefully in the next update they may be testing this and using this as a, uh, a test to actually see if it works and stays working. Uh, but hopefully this is a good step in the right direction and hopefully the other guys will be fixed very soon. But there you go, like I said as well, this is on the uh, 1.4 update beta I think it is. So it's PC only I think as well right now. But it's a step in the right direction. Anyway guys, thank you for watching. That was another level 4 weapon merchant location guide. That was the scribe. Thank you guys and I will see you in the next one.